So you got yourself a brand new Fire Stick or Fire TV so you can watch your favorite streaming content. Probably the first thing you're going to notice when you go into these websites, particularly the sports streaming websites, is just how many adverts they have. We have these pop-up adverts, we have these video-based adverts, and it just really ruins the experience. Now, wouldn't it be amazing if you could apply a single change to your Fire Stick and through this change now, you won't see any more adverts on any more websites. So in this video today, let me show you exactly how you can follow the steps in this process. And once you're done, you can go ahead and enjoy all of your favorite streaming content, 100% free and now 100% ad free. All you need to do is just hit that like button, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So with all of that being said, Let's get started. If you're new to the channel and you want to stay up to date with the latest tech tutorials, the latest Fire Stick, Android and Android TV tips and tricks, then please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. It's a small click from you, but it makes a big difference to me. Thank you. So I'm doing my demonstration on my third generation Fire TV Q, but you can follow this process on any device where you can run the Silk browser. So all of your Amazon devices, your Fire TVs, your Fire tablets, Fire TV sticks, your cubes, all of those devices are supported, but you can also sideload the Silk browser onto your Android TV devices. Now, the reason why the Silk browser is very, very popular, especially for your third party streaming websites is the Silk browser handles those pop-ups on those websites really well, because as you know, these websites do provide free content and the way they make their money is by serving adverts. And anything you click on, any link, normally tries to take you to another page first to show you the advert. Now what the Silk Browser does, it says to you that, are you sure you want to leave this page? So in most cases you don't because the content is where you are and it's just the advert that's now on another page. So the fact that's built into the Silk Browser is why it's very, very popular with people looking for free streaming content. And we can now take that to the next level and just completely block all adverts in that application. Now to start the process, if you just open up Silk, let's open that up. If I just do a super quick demo of this very popular um, streaming website, right on the homepage, we have four different adverts at the top. A few of them are video-based adverts. If I scroll down a bit, we can see another video-based advert on the right, another picture advert. It just I mean, it's just very, very typical of these streaming sites. So let's leave that as a benchmark or something that we can test against. And let's now apply this change. Now, what we want to do first is if you press the context key, which is one with the three lines, and we can go over to where it says menu. Let's click on that. Scroll down and let's go over to where it says settings. Now, there's a couple of key things we're going to change in here. So let's start with the where it says privacy and security. Let's click on that. Here, for example, you can enable safe browsing if you want to take the privacy and the protection to the next level. But on my device, I'll leave that as off. Now here, for example, the do not send track request is a way that you can minimize websites tracking you, monitoring what you're doing. So make sure that is set to on. I believe the default option is actually off. So make sure that's set to on. Let's go back. The key thing we're looking for here is use secure DNS. So let's click on that. Now DNS as a super quick summary is what resolves the domain names, the stuff that we try to connect to, we try to browse to into IP addresses. So when I type in google.com or techdoctoruk.com, DNS's job is to tell me what is the IP address for that particular domain. Once it has the IP address, then my Firestick will then connect to the IP address. So for example, the AdGuard DNS servers are specifically designed to block adverts. And anytime they get requests saying, you know, give us the IP address of this domain name, they have a massive database and they know that this particular domain actually serves adverts. So when they get that request saying, give us the IP address for this domain, they just deny or block the request and they return nothing. And when they return nothing, it means that your device won't be able to connect to that advert domain. And because of that, that advert just won't load on your device. And you end up getting much better performance in your browsing because your device is now no longer waiting for those adverts to load. And it just means that you'll have a much better, much faster and ad free browsing experience. Now to enable that, let's click on choose another provider. Let's click on the down arrow. 
And here we're going to select customize because we want to type in a custom address. Let's click on that and let's press down and let's now type in the address. And you have to make sure you type this address in correctly because if there's any typos, anything incorrect, it will just appear as red, which means there's a problem with that address. So double check, pause the video. You can watch it a few times. Make sure you get this address incorrect. And that address is basic is HTTPS. And then you want to do a colon, which is this thing here. Then you want to do two forward slashes, go back into text and let's type in DNS dot add God. And then you want to do hyphen. Let's do hyphen and then DNS Dot com. You want to do a forward slash and we're going to type in the word DNS query. So DNS hyphen query. And just for a test, I will actually type or do a slight typo just so I can show you if you do type it in slightly incorrectly. So DNS query. But I'm now going to add in an extra Y and now let's click on next. And what happens if you get a message saying that this is an invalid DNS provider. So just ensure that you have typed the address incorrectly because it is checked straight away. Let's go back in. I want to take off the extra Y. Go to next. And that message then disappears. So that is the correct address we want. Let's now go back. We're now using secure DNS. This option here improves silk browsing. Just turn that off because we don't want to be sending any extra information back to Amazon about our browsing. So make sure that's off. Let's now press back. And that's pretty much it, guys. So we've now made that change, which means from this point forward, Anytime Silk Browser tries to connect to any address, it will use those AdGuard DNS servers, which are automatically designed to stop or block all requests going to advert domains. Let's now do a real-time test. Let's go back, back again. We're on this website here. We can see the adverts on the right. We can see that video-based advert and something else at the top. Let me now just refresh the page. One click. We can now get a blank box at the top. So the advert has not loaded. If I scroll down, we can see we get a blank box there. No advert there. Keep scrolling down and it's all blank now, guys. So those adverts are now blocked from loading on my device, which means I can now go ahead and enjoy all of my favorite streaming websites, 100% free. And of course now 100% ad free. So that's pretty much of this video, guys. Many thanks for watching. Just a quick word from one of our partners before you go. If you are looking for the best way, the easiest way to take your privacy to the next level, right now there's a super special offer just for the next two weeks, giving you 75% off. That means all of your devices can be protected with a VPN, get maximum privacy, ensure nobody can track what you're doing, ensure your ISP can't track you, advertisers can't monitor you to get all of that with really fast speeds at just under $3 a month. I do think this special offer is definitely worthwhile checking out. Do have a look in the video description and pinned comment if you want to take up this special offer and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.